shouldn't be here. Hi, how are you? Oh my gosh. I feel like I haven't seen you in so long. Yeah, what's up? You have a date today? Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. And you want me to do your makeup? Of course, there's no need to ask any further. I am more than happy to help you. Yeah, and you have to tell me all about your date. Yeah, no, I, that's the only payment I need. Don't even try and give me cash. I am so interested. I feel like we haven't spoken in forever. Yeah, you have to get me caught up on everything in your life. Yeah. Um, so, I always have my makeup on me. So, I have some brushes, some products, and I'm just super excited, okay? Alright, great. So, let's put some foundation on that face first. I'm assuming you came with primer. No. Alright. That's fine. That's fine. I can totally put some primer on you. Alright. Alright. And... Okay, so. How did you meet? <laughs> Sorry. How did you meet this lucky specimen? Oh, on a dating app? That's fun. How long have you been talking to him? Okay. It's been going well. Kinda. <laughs> we must like this one quite a bit to have me do makeup for you. A little more. <laughs> yeah. I can imagine. But best to stay humble. You don't know how the date's gonna go, you know? Yeah, that's the mindset, isn't it? <laughs> Gotta go into it with minimal expectations. <laughs> You never know how people are going to be, you know. Sometimes you meet people online and they are completely different than how you expected them to be. <laughs> okay. Can you close your eyelids for me? Great. Going very gently over the eyelids. Wonderful. Yeah, my nails look very barren right now because I just realized like a minute ago that one of my nails had popped off and I had no idea. So, that's always fun. I love when that happens. <laughs> okay, so let's wait for the uh, primer to settle. Just blend it a little bit. Okay. Okay, great. Now let's do some concealer. So just look at my nose for me. Why am I do concealer first? You'll see, you'll see. Trust me. This is my job. Trust the process. Oh, sorry. Got some where I should not have. Do I do this with my clients? No. But I know you and I love you and I'm doing this for free. So tell me more about the lucky person. They're really nice. That's good. Um, what about, do they have a job or they're working? That's good. Yeah. Where are you guys going out to eat? No, we're too expensive, right? Okay. <laughs> Just making sure. You know, never know. Don't want to be trapped in a place where you have to pay a lot of money that you can't pay. <laughs> I know he's offering to pay. But, you know. Try to save him. Let's do um, foundation next. Yes, there is a reason that I do foundation next. <laughs> and I'll explain it to you. So, I like to blend my concealer this way because I found that when the foundation is over top of the concealer, it kind of blends better. Um, I guess it's just like a shade thing. Yeah. It really varies per person, but with your undertones, I thought it was the better course of action. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's get this on your forehead as well. Can you close your eyes for me? Thank you. Yep, 
I'm gonna put it right by your eyebrow. Not your eyelid like I did before, though. Okay, and by your chin. Okay. And under your cheeks. Okay, and I'll put some on your neck, too, to blend it better. Can you look up? hair done recently? Yeah, it looks really good. Okay, next. Um, I used the blender. Okay, all right, can you just look straight at me? Yeah, I really used to not be a big beauty blender person, and I also used to use my hands, and it does really depend on my effort level and how much time I want to put into my makeup. Today I did just use my fingers, but since it is a special occasion, a beauty blender is necessary. I have a friend who, when she came over to do my makeup, because this is just what girls do, um, it was... A big earful when I told her I used my fingers. Yeah, but she was not having it. <laughs> but trust me, I won't. I won't. I won't say anything. I will not say a thing because realistically, we all have those moments. All right. Okay. All right. So now, let's just do some contouring. Yeah, your base first, because eyes are simple and can be done later. I know, controversial take. I don't find eyeliner difficult, but that's usually because mine's not even, so. Okay, hold still. This powder is pretty cheap, but you don't need expensive product to have a good outcome. I mean, sometimes you do. Depends who you're doing makeup for. Maybe if you were like the Queen of England or like a celebrity, but us, we don't need anything that crazy. Especially because, trust me, guys don't notice. They have no idea. They couldn't tell you if a lipstick was $5 or 300. Yeah, no clue. And hey, it's a benefit for us. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna take my darker contour and put it under your jaw. So just look up a little bit. other side as well. You've been working out lately. Well, you look good. No, seriously, you look good. I'm jealous. I need to go to the gym. Thank you. I know. It's not even like that I feel bad because I feel good. Like, I look good. I'm, <laughs> you know, <laughs> we look good, but it's mainly about like energy level and to feel more motivated, you know, to do something. <laughs> okay, great. All right, and now let's do around your forehead in a lighter contour because we don't want too dark of a hairline. Maybe guys will actually get suspicious at that point. Please don't notice my nails. I know you're looking. Please don't look. You'll do my nails for me? You're joking? Wait, actually? Thank you. Oh my god, I knew I loved you. <laughs> okay. Alright. Wonderful. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with a 
highlight shade. Okay. And put it on your nose and under your eyes. Okay, hold on. Give me one second. I know, I know. Not supposed to do this, but it's okay. Promise. Just blending it a little more than initially anticipated. Okay. Okay, let me just Okay. You are looking good. I, no, you're not a client, so it really doesn't matter, I promise. Yeah, no, uh, I think you're, I think you'll be okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I think I've done much worse to you over the years. Alrighty, now let's do some, actually, I'll do some powder with my CoverGirl True Blend. I am, you know, usually not a cover girl girly. I am usually a L'Oreal person, but this really isn't a bad powder. It's actually pretty good. Um, I don't really know if I use it for its intended purpose, but I think it's quite good. Let's use this powder. Okay. Look at me straight on. Okay. And open your eyes really wide like this. Thank you. Do you get your makeup done? Not frequently. <laughs> so this is like a really special person, huh? Yeah. I'm glad to hear it. How long have you guys been talking? A few months. And this is your first date. Why? Why, why, why? What has taken you both so long? Life gets busy, but not that busy. Oh, I see. Sometimes there's things in life that you can't control. I've been there recently. We have to take life one step at a time and just hope the people around us are willing to love us through it. Okay. Let's do your forehead as well. Next, let's do some plumper lipstick. When is your date? Okay, yeah, we'll do this now. Um, because I don't know. Yeah, we don't have a lot of time. Okay, so look at me. Alright, now just go like this. Alright, great. And while that's plumping, I'm gonna do your eyelashes, okay? Actually, do you want eyeliner? Alright, I'll do eyeliner. Um, do you want like a wing like this or more subtle? Yeah, for sure, more subtle. I do eyeliner like not every day, but when you get used to it, you can do it a lot more frequently. So hold still for me. your other eye. Alright. I am worried it did not go well onto your eye because of the foundation, so I just do it one more time. Okay. 
Okay. Great. Alright, now let's curl your lashes. Just look straight at me. Yep, and I'll tell you when to look up. Okay, now look up. Okay, good. Let me know if I'm hurting you. Great. Now the other eye, look straight at me. Okay, now look up. Yep, I do not want to hurt you, and this can be the most painful part for most people. Yep, because I try to get really close to the root. Alright, look again, and straight up. Good, look straight forward. Great. Alrighty. So now, let's do some mascara. This is my favorite mascara. I have a lot of it. I threw out actually my third because I finished it, but I have a lot of it. So, do not fret. So, look straight at me. Okay. they don't get too clumpy, but sometimes I do fall victim to the 2016 lash. We cannot help it. It is in our blood. Okay. Alright. You look so pretty. Yeah. No, I'm serious. You look beautiful. I mean, you came in here and you looked beautiful, but you look gorgeous. Okay, let's contour that nose. Yep, this is usually my final step because it feels like the completing factor. <laughs> okay, look at me. And I'm doing your nose contour in accordance to your nose face to help any facial symmetry. Thank you for being my friend. I'm grateful for you every day, and any person would be lucky to have you in their life. I'm sorry for getting sappy. No, don't, no, don't tear up. Goodness. Okay. Okay, and... Darker contour. Okay, now let's do our highlighter. Okay, and let's do it. Yeah, this is like loose powder in here all at the bottom, so I can really even go just on the cap and get some too. Like, there's a lot of this stuff. A lot of it, you see. It's magical. Okay, let me help you. Right and around your eyes. Okay, great. Your lashes are drooping just a tad. So, do you mind if I do the makeup no no and curl them again? Okay, great. I, I always curl it after. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I just need to make sure that. Yeah, the issue usually happens when you're curling eyelashes with mascara on them when the mascara is not fully like crunchy and dry but it's been long enough so it'll be good okay three two one just look forward again okay and gorgeous now the other eye three two one
wonderful. Okay, and I have the perfect color for you. Okay, yeah, I think this is the perfect shade. Shade Hibiscus, okay? It's like a pinky shade, and it will look perfect. It'll tie the entire look together. It looks great with your skin tone. So, look at me. For the longest time, I hated makeup. That's because it was so hard to find my shade, because I have a little bit of a green undertone, um, and I just felt, you know, different from the rest of my family, because of my undertones. And um, I was so jealous of the girls that, you know, like, just weren't, like, green. <laughs> but. As I've grown up, I've definitely appreciated it more. And makeup is a skill that takes time to learn, and you don't get it overnight. And I think that was really hard for me to face and deal with. Just all of it. Um, and also just like being a girl and, I don't know, just so much of it. I just didn't like. Let me use this pen, a uh, pen, sorry, pencil around your lips too. Great. You look phenomenal. And I know you're gonna have an amazing time today. And if you don't, tell me what happens. If you need an Uber, let me know. I'll be there to save you anytime. If you need an excuse, more than happy to be your excuse. But based on what you've told me today, it seems like you're in for a treat. I will see you after the fact, and hopefully you like your makeup. Okay, good. I'm glad. Sometimes when other people do my makeup, I wind up disliking it, and I never know what to say. But you can be honest with me. You genuinely like it? Okay. Thank God. <laughs> Alright. I'll talk to you after your date, okay? Alright. I love you. Big hugs. Big hugs. Alright, talk to you later. Bye.